Hello everyone, today's video content is Analysis of the Real Questions of the MB 280 Exam and Explanation of Relevant Knowledge Points. The following test questions are all from our question bank and they were updated on October 28, 2024. Study Guide Question 1. You need to make the active phase of a business process flow visible within a specific view. Which two actions should you complete? Each correct answer presents a complete solution. The knowledge points of this question are Configuring and visualizing business process flow. To show the active phase in a specific view, you can add columns or adjust visibility in the app Dallas Niner. This helps teams easily track where they are in a process and manage tasks effectively. So the correct answers are Adding columns from the customer table to the view lets you pull in specific data, making it easier to see and manage active interactions. Adjusting visibility in the app designer lets you highlight active phases so users can quickly see where things stand with a client. Question 2. To configure search and enable administrators to locate records related to a specific breed such as poodles which action is required. The knowledge points of this question are Database search and indexing configuration Setting up search and indexing in Dynamics 365 makes it easy for users to find specific records like a certain pet breed. Index tables ensure faster, more accurate searches, keeping workflows smooth. So the correct answer is Ensuring that tables are indexed means records are easier to find. Indexing speeds up search, helping users quickly locate specific breeds or details. Question 3. To identify duplicate records in the pet database and enable caregivers to merge them, what should you create? The knowledge points of this question are Duplicate detection and merging Duplicate detection jobs and rules automatically spot and manage duplicate records, keeping data unique and accurate. This helps avoid confusion and ensures teams work with clean, reliable information. So the correct answer is One detection job and two rules are enough to spot and handle duplicates. The job scans the data and the rules define what to look for, keeping things simple and efficient. Question 4. To initiate a trigger-based journey to send introductory welcome emails to new leads, which trigger should you select to start the journey? The knowledge points of this question are Trigger configuration for customer journey Trigger-based journeys in Dynamics 365 send automatic responses to key events like a welcome email for new leads. Setting these up makes marketing timely and more personal, boosting customer engagement. So the correct answer is The Dataverse record change trigger works perfectly here. It kicks off the journey as soon as a new lead is created ensuring that welcome emails go out right on time. Question 5. To assign territory management responsibilities to user 2 with the least privilege, which role should be assigned? The knowledge points of this question are Role permissions and least privilege assignment Assigning roles with only the necessary permissions, like sales manager for territory management, ensures secure access without extra privileges, keeping data safe and compliance simple. So the correct answer is The sales manager role has just enough permissions to manage territories without any extra access. It's the right balance for secure and efficient role assignment. If you have any questions about the MB 280 exam, please leave a message in the comment area or contact us directly. Thank you everyone for watching. See you next time.